Hello, gorgeous ladies and gentlemen of the realm. Fairy Vixen here, back again with another video, and we're going to get right into it. This is going to be the last video for box number one of this three box lot. And look at the little butterfly. Very sparkly. That's a cute one on a black chain. Cool. And this chain, well the chain is black, but it's got some sparkle to it too. So that's cool. Yeah. Here's a big old shell with a one of these over the top and a hook. And it looks like, wait, is that backwards? Maybe. Eh. There we go. That's how it goes. I don't know that I like that. You can't even see the the black filigree with it over top of that. Hmm, that's weird. And right, we have a stretchy wood, small beads, black and blonde. Neat. Here's the other one of these that we saw a bit ago. I think at the end of this box we're going to start with the um, alternating between earring sort and uh, regular jewelry boxes. This is pretty. It's a navy and it's Peruvian wire work. And look at this catch. That's kind of cool. This is all just wire bent, bent to serve you, bend it. It's all just how you bend it. That's really neat. So intricate. I love that kind of work. Hmm, what are you? Very jingly. Um, this is an overdone purse charm. I mean, it would probably be okay without that big giant thing, but... And it's ringing-ing. Ah, there's the ringing one, right there. It's a little bell. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's from Rio de Janeiro. Keychain. A famous statue of Jesus from Rio. Ooh, this is nice. It's shell, but it's also got like a metallic wash on it. That's really pretty. I like it. It's plain, but it's nice. Frog watch. <laughs> uh oh. It's missing its second hand and fell off. Darn it. Dang it. Dang it, Bobby. Here is a glass stretch bracelet on just a rubber cord. Not very well done. <clears throat> and it was, they were asking $20 for this. 20 Or 20 whatever, I don't know. Could be some other, um, some other currency, I guess. It's pretty glass beads, though. Pretty glass beads. There's nothing really to set it apart, though. It's kind of run-of-the-mill. Hmm. There's the other one of those. And then we have this one. Little plastic petals. They're like a smoky and a black matte. Pla 
plastic and it's kind of Y. It's a Y, yeah, it's a Y necklace. Cute. Frosted. Yawning, yawning, yawning. Uh, okay, here's this one. Oh, this is nice. It's pink and and uh, smoky quartz, I think. Or glass. They're all glass, I think, if, if I really am honest. But it's pink and like a smoky quartz color. Here we go. Pretty. That's a nice one. Oh, look at these. Oh, come on. I'm telling you something. Please. Ooh. There we go. We have a cookie lee. Very small, thin, long, stamped gold tone. And I actually had one in my auction box that is the same thing in silver tone. So they're a cute little pair. I would keep them together. Pretty neat. Look at that. Very cool. <laughs> and they're both cookie lee. Cookie lee. <laughs> I'm starting to like Cookie Lee. I mean, I've seen a whole lot of it in this last batch. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's tangled up in it. No broke. No. All right. There are some single earrings. And there's a, a memory wire with black and orange. Here's the other one of, oh darn, it doesn't have the hook anymore. Oh yeah. Right. No, don't fall on the floor. This is probably going to be a short video because I want to, when I get to the bottom, I'm going to I'm not going to open the next box right away. And this is beautiful beads. Beautiful crystal beads. But we have this part, but we don't have that part. Somebody put a twist tie on it to make it so that you could hook it. But they're knotted and they're gorgeous. And that's really sad. But... If you like craft lots, those will probably be in there. Like I said the other day, I have a craft lot I'm putting together that's going to be a full, um, medium, flat rate for, oh, I can't remember what the heck I had on that. This is gorgeous. Another Cookie Lee, and it's got like a citrine color and a garnet color some purple some black it's just got all kinds of colors these are all um acrylic but they're very pretty they look like real stone pretty 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 here is <laughs> Here's a whole knot of things. There's an earring. What the heck? That is, I don't know what that is. It has a name on the back though. I do it. No. Hey. We got the yawny tonight. Oh, this one's cute. This is a little, another little necklace. Little dangly bits. 
very plain. Very nice. I like that one. I like the ones that sit up by her collarbone. Very nice. This is a very nice white leather bolo, but it is missing a stone. Um, so that would make very, it would be very easy to fix. You just find a rock you like and slap it on there. And this guy is vintage tangled. <laughs> It's a trembler. Look at it. That was not trembling as much because it's caught up in the chainage. No, don't be. Don't be tangled. They don't like it. No. Okay, well, we will untangle that at some point. Ooh, look at all this stuff tangled up. Nah. This. That. Okay. So what we have tangled up in, in the butterfly is this uh, set of earrings and this necklace that is crocheted. This part's crocheted and it goes down to this bit, which is very nice glass and um, then it goes up to this chain so and then it's kind of tangled up in that so we'll mess with that later and what's next sorry I need to rub my eye um, <laughs> we have Another three strand of this type with little red rhinestones. Very nice. I have so many of these in different colors. <laughs> mm, untangle, please. There we go. Da. Well, it's almost untangled. This one is the only one that's kind of caught up. Oh well, it's red and and uh, gunmetal. Very nice. Nice. Oh, this is cute. This is a bolo uh, necklace with a pave pink rhinestone heart. It's got all of its all of its stones are there. It's like about a choker length. That would sit right in the hollow of your throat, I think. That's very nice. Two, and it does not have a name on it. Now, let's see. This is another Cookie Lee that... It kind of matches another one. That uh, both of them... I had two of them, and... It's the same kind of construction. It's shorter though. Same color pearls. Same color beads. So yeah. That's neat. Very cool. Ooh, I love this. This is glass beads. Pretty, pretty glass beads. My two favorites together. Purple and teal. Very nice. This goes like this. And they're wrapped. They're little wrapped beads. Very cool. We like it. <laughs> you can walk like a normal person. You don't have to tiptoe. <laughs> okay. So you're not doing it for me? <laughs> good night. Mm, I love you. Hello and good night. <laughs> I 
rhinestones with that just one of them springy ringy and then I'm broken <laughs> I don't know what that was but it's broken here's a a mood ring it says best friends best friends best friends best friend best friend it says it twice that's weird um, but it's a mood ring that's cool here is, oh, I hope I can find the other one in the next box. It is a very pretty um, amethyst bead. This is a little stretchy ankle bracelet in Halloweeny colors. Here's another cookie bead. It is broken though. It's hearts. It's little hearts. And they're very cute. But it needs repair. So it's really heavy too. Oh, I lost one. I lost a bead. I lost it. Alright. Maybe I will um, grab another package. After I'm done with this, because we got a whole five minutes left. Here's a cute little plain bracelet. And a big giant earring with a pearl. And a pear on the card. And this is gray pearl and hematite. Pretty nice. And then, oh, hey, look, there's a pair here. Imagine that. Little blue guys. Little, little blue with some filigree. <laughs> Very nice. Cutesy, cutesy. And here's a neat one on brass. It is a clip on brass. With enamel over top. I don't know if it was done after the fact or if that's the original design or what. But I don't see a mark on it. It feels really good, like it's a nice one. And there we have, oh, here we have it. And one more flippity floppity. And that will go in Maury's box because she collects flippity floppity. <laughs> every time, girl, every time I find one, it's yours. <laughs> unless, unless you say, please stop sending me those. There, now we have this, this apart. It will flap its wing. And this one is so cute. I don't know, I think this might be my favorite. Besides the the blue and purple, the blue and purple with the glass, and then and then these guys, these two matching ones, love those. Okay, so now oh, we only need two minutes. Two minutes. Well, here's one. Here's one that was sitting on the pool table for oh, I don't know, a couple months because. Cubs was trying to untangle it, and then his daughter came over, and while she was sitting there talking to him, she untangled it. <laughs> it's a Y necklace, and it's very, it tangles very easily, but it's unnamed, but very beautiful. We will put that in the box, too. Yes, we'll put that there. Okay, well, I guess you noticed this. I got, I got, I got, I got that. <laughs> and we're 20 seconds away from, oh, from the ink. And I have this, this necklace that I showed you before, this one, with a broken thing. I found the other piece of it. 
and it's absolutely beautiful. It's real pretty. Pretty, pretty stone. And I thought it looked really neat with this one. Because it kind of matches the stone. So I'll probably be fixing that and making that into a lot in one of my auctions. Maybe, I don't know. Okay, we are at 20. I would like to thank you all for being here. Please leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment in the down there. If you see something you can't live without, please leave a timestamp in the comments of the item that you would like. Or you can send me an email with that same information to my email, which is in the description. But I also need the title of the video and the date that it was posted so that I can find your item for you. Please remember that I love each and every one of you. And be yourself. Because everyone else is taken. Bye-bye.